Hey guys, welcome back with another video on our channel Learn with Gigs. In today's video, I will discuss with you what are the different perks of having Microsoft certification of Power BI that is PL-300. I will discuss with you when, why and how one should go for this exam and as an individual, one should not have any kind of confusion in their mind. Okay, so let's start and before starting, if you are new to this channel, please hit the subscribe button to stay updated with all my videos. So let's start. So first of all, let me go to the when page. So what is the or when is the best time to clear Microsoft exam and have the certificate? So what I will recommend is that a person should work for at least a year, like uh, he or she should work for at least one year in any of the real life projects in their companies. And then only they should go for this certification. It's not that a fresher should not uh, uh, go for this exam or uh, they are not allowed for this exam. They can go ahead and clear this exam. It's their choice. But if you are having one year of experience in real life projects of Power BI, then only I would recommend you to go for this exam. So I hope this is clear. When is the best time to clear this Microsoft exam? Okay, let's move to why. Why we should go for this particular exam? Okay, so if you, if you are preparing for this exam, then you will learn a lot of things. So it's not only about getting the certificate, but also it's the journey which will make you learn at the competitive level. Okay, so this is what I wanted to share with you first and then let's go one by one. What are different? Uh, what are the different benefits if you put this on your resume? Okay, so what is the first point? So the first point is Nokri.com. So if you're looking to switch, you have at least one year of experience in Power BI projects. And if you're looking to switch to different company, then obviously you will apply in Nokri, right? You will definitely look for the calls from Nokri.com. So <clears throat> in general, recruiters give max to max 10 seconds to any resume. So your resume should be a catchy one, which includes all the points that a recruiter is looking for. So in the in the achievement in the achievements part, if you mention this that you are a Microsoft certified Power BI data analyst, then obviously it will have an advantage over other candidates and the chances of getting a call for interview. So this is one of the perks of having Microsoft Power BI certification. Now let's move to our second advantage of having this certification. LinkedIn. So suppose you are not getting the calls from Nokri.com. Okay. So you are getting minimal calls from Nokri. Now other than Nokri. LinkedIn is the most professional site where you will get the calls from the recruiters directly. So the recruiters there on LinkedIn write some keywords. For example, they will write Microsoft certified data analyst or Microsoft certified power BI, power BI data analyst. So when they will hit the enter button, so whatever uh, profiles on LinkedIn, which has that certification credentials will appear to that person to that recruiter. So obviously if you have the certification, if you have the credentials, so your profile will be presented in front of that in, uh, recruiter. Now that recruiter will view your profile and there is a chance that you will get a call for interview. Okay. So from LinkedIn also you will get this advantage of getting interview calls if you are looking for switch. Okay. So and these are the two most uh, professional sites from where we get the interview calls. Right. So that's why I mentioned these two only. Now let's move to our third point. Okay. And this is about appraisals. So if you are working in a company, okay, <clears throat> so you must be aware that there is a cycle and after that cycle, uh, you, you get some rating and on top of that rating, you get your appraisals. Okay. So in that particular, when you are about to get the rating, you, if you have cleared this exam, if you have the certification, then you can tell the same to your uh, manager or your, to, or to your team lead, whoever is providing the rating to you. So that they are aware that you have uh, cleared this exam and you should be aware that this certification cost rupees 5700 in India, right? So if you have cleared this exam, if you have cleared this exam at this competitive level, then should present it in front of your manager also in front of your team lead also and then try to so that they can give you some extra rating and at the end you will get a better appraisal, better compensation. Okay, so these are the three main advantages or perks you can say of having Microsoft Power, Power BI certification. Okay, now let's move to the last point. How you can clear this exam? How will you clear this Microsoft exam? So if you search in Google, you will directly write. Uh, 
Now, how to prepare for this exam? You just have to Google it, right? You have to go on Google, type PL-300 uh, exam preparation. There are different sites available there which can uh, help you to clear this exam. There are basically you have to practice practice dumps. Okay, so if you are uh, if you are practicing those dumps that are present on different sites there, then obviously you will be able to clear this exam. That dumps contains most of the relevant questions and you just have to figure out which are those dumps which are relevant to the latest changes that have been made in this for this exam okay so and the best way to get those dumps is that whenever you uh, like try to increase your connections on your linkedin okay once you uh, once your connections are more then somebody uh, must be there who would have cleared this exam and he or she would have shared the post that he or, uh, that they have cleared the exam so directly search uh, directly go to that person on linkedin connect with that person directly ask for the dumps people are very professional and they are ready to help you on linkedin you will just connect with them ask them about the dumps they will def definitely give you the dumps you don't even have to search anywhere on the google you just ask them they will provide you the dumps practice them and just if you are confident confident enough go for the exam schedule it and clear it it's not so tough okay you can easily clear it once you have a proper strategy and you have a proper preparation okay i have cleared all your doubts and you have a proper clarity now how when and why you should go for this particular exam so if you find this video useful please share it with all your friends so that their uh, doubts also gets resolved okay thank you